They do have a... I noticed a little... Damn. A little bit of a problem in this game with, um... Oh, shit! Uh Welcome back, everybody, to Enshrouded. I'm an old guy. Give me an end in this episode. We are going to uh, continue questing. But first, uh, let's go ahead and turn in this quest that we went and got the saw blades for in the last episode and see uh, what the deal is with this. Circular saw blades of highest quality. You brought back some circular saw blades, huh? Scavengers give you trouble? Uh, yeah, they kind of did. <laughs> sort of kind of blew myself up. Uh, so Thornhold didn't hold. A shame. Well, let's craft the table saw in their honor. Put it where I can see it. Uh, craft. Table saw. Look at that. Um, oh. Um, what did I do with the saw blades? Probably put them in here. Yeah. Uh, I did a bunch of off-camera uh, resource gathering. Uh, so mostly what I went after was twigs. So now you can see I've got several stacks of twigs. Um, just because, you know, as I've mentioned before, I've had a bit of a, bit of a challenge uh, keeping... Uh, those in stock, you know, for uh, because of the, all the arrows and stuff that we use. Okay, let's try this again. Craft, table saw, space, go. Got it. Okay, do we still have our other saw blade? We do. It's probably not worth anything to us. Very good. Okay, so this is... This is our carpenter's workshop in this corner of the house. So, how big is this thing? It's not... It's not too big. Um, I guess we could probably just put it here. Sure. Let's just put it right here. I don't want it to clip in, into the wall, so we'll hold it out just a bit. Nice. All right. So in here we can make wood planks, uh, which just require wood logs, which I have a lot of. So let's go ahead and throw at least two stacks of wood logs in here. And there we go. Now, if we talk to him again, I, got my eye on you. <laughs> I think we can we make the large uh, storage now. Yes. Oh, that's nice. We can. Um, we just need the planks and then metal sheets and stuff. Okay. So now that I know that. Um, because I am, you know, some of these chests are like just jam packed full, like this, uh, like our food chest, for example. Uh, and I've been having to overflow stuff into here. So let's, you know, oh, <laughs> check that out. Look at the handle. It's just kind of moving. That's cool. Um, let's take some scrap metal. I got a decent amount of scrap metal, maybe two stacks worth. And turn that into plates, which we, yeah, we do over here. Uh, and we need charcoal. Lots and lots of charcoal I have. Let's grab a couple stacks of that, too. There we go. Okay, so we'll turn that into metal sheets. Uh, again, this saw blade's probably worthless to us now, but... I'll hang on to it for now anyways, just for no no reason. <laughs> good, no good reason. Um, all right. Now, here's what I think I want to do. My half-timbered blocks. You found, oh, yeah, let's turn this in too. You found my half-timbered blocks, huh? Keep them in case you want to make something masterful with them. A new home built to last. Okay, so... Uh... Yeah, we can still only make that. Oh, wait. No, this is an advanced glider. When did we learn that? I don't know, but we can't make it until uh, until we get linen, which uh, which I think is actually the hunter quest. Secret doors, I think. Yeah, just new, new doors here. Really nice looking stuff there. Um, Just looking to see what else. Yeah, so we need bronze bars. To make that, I haven't even found bronze bars yet. We found copper bars, but not bronze. Okay, cool. So, um, yeah, we need linen if we're going to make that. But I, I'll tell you what I really want to do. Uh, I really want to be able to smelt copper bars so that I can then make copper arrows. So I think 
that means we're going to have to do some more quests for this guy. Oh, look at those fences. Copper fence. That's cool. Grappling hook pole anchor. Add this pole anchor to your buildings to pull yourself forward onto... Oh, oh neat. Okay, so you would do that in your own base. And same thing there. A swing and a pole. Nice. Okay. That is very cool. Um, I guess if it's got this diamond, that means it's something new. Spectral shield. I learned that a long time ago, actually. Uh, this magic shield allows you to block against physical attacks. Where does it... Where does it... Let's just make it. Let's see where it goes. Um, okay. Oh, it takes the place of... Oh, wait a second. No, we don't want to do that. That's that's quite a bit weaker. Um. Oh, that is cool, though. Look at that. It's like a magic shield. Oh, man, we should have made that a long time ago. Uh, but this is still far better. I mean, this has... 7 block, 20 parry, 110 durability, and it gives us 25 health. Um, 13 parry. Oh, it's poison resistant, though. Okay. Well, um, available. Equipped. Maybe, you know, maybe if we're in a situation where poison is a bit of trouble, we could... We could equip that instead, but I, I'm not going to carry it around with me and, you know, take up a slot. But we'll definitely hang on to it. Um, yeah, let's put it in here. Okay, but the thing is, is I, um, the recipe for making the, the copper bars uh, has to be in the forge. I mean, and so we got to unlock that. And... Did you break something? And I... Hmm, I wonder if we would need a crucible for that. Let me see something here. Like I said, I don't want to take on a bunch of new quests until we kind of finish up the early earlier quests. So this is... I think that's the hunter quest. That's a hunter quest. Partake in ethical grave digging. That's probably... from the, uh, the alchemist. That's from the alchemist. Hmm, maybe we don't have a, a quest from him to... Okay, I'll bet you it's the Crucible quest, then. Watch out! Sparks flying! <laughs> to do my best work, I really need a smelter, but crafting a smelter requires a Crucible. I used to have one. I'll bet the scavengers got to. It's probably at their mine, way up north in the Revelwood. Okay. Oh, we already... Wait, we already lock, unlocked stuff without even doing the quest? What the heck? Did it unlock the... No, it didn't unlock that. Tell me what so sometimes just talking to these guys will unlock stuff without even doing the quest. Oh, there's the rake! Oh, they must have fixed it! Awesome! Uh, I did notice that, um, that, that there was a patch. Uh, today is February 7th, and I haven't played in a couple of days. Oh, nice. They fixed it. Okay. That is fantastic. Uh, wait a second. No, 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 no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, it's not that. It was the it was the normal rake that we needed. Damn it. I forget. It, it, it should show up here. Did they fix it here? They did. <laughs> nice. They did. Okay. Let's make this. Uh, oh, we have to make it at the workbench. They did fix it. Okay, good. All right, and then, then we'll make the better rake hey! with him. Tell me what you need. There we go. All right, nice. We finally have ourselves a rake. It's a beautiful thing. I still, for the time being, though, I still think I'm going to um keep farming just, you know, out at the... At, at, you know, at the farm place that we've been going to, because why not? I mean, we can fast travel to and from there easily, and it's already there. So yeah, let's just keep using that. Okay, so 
I think that this is what we're going to need to do. So even though that's a, a quote unquote new quest and these are older, I really want to, you know, start being able to make copper arrows. So we're going to, we're going to actually move that to the front and that's what we're going to do. Okay. So if we take a look on the map, it says it's over there. Oh, wow. That's right next to, yeah, you know what? When I was out and about, you know, just, just gathering resources, I found this place and I, I put a, a flame altar down there because I figured, you know, we're probably gonna have to come back here. But I didn't actually go in and explore the whole thing, as you can see. Uh, so that was uh, quite, quite a bit of forethought on my part there. <laughs> okay, so uh, I didn't know that we were actually gonna go there right now, though. So I just figured we probably would have to at some point. So yeah, that worked out pretty good. Okay, let's see. We've got 216 scrap arrows. Um, looks like we're doing pretty good for bots. We have these now too, so we'll be taking those. And, you know, these are potions, so they, they don't take the up the food buff slot, which is nice. Do I have any skills? Ooh, I got three skills, ladies and gentlemen. Um, we're work, We want to work in the survivor tree. And unfortunately, I have to take this to get into here, unless I wanted to go all the way around, which I don't. Um, so we're just going to do it. Kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Okay. But now that, you know, that's a gateway to some of these uh, really good ones that I want to get, like Sweet Tooth and Metabolism and the one, yeah, this one gives us an extra food slot, so it'll be worth it in the long run for sure. Okay, so let's see. We got a good supply of food there. Everything's repaired. Uh, we're fully rested, so yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. Hopefully this isn't one of those quests that send us... To the first place and then send us to the second place and then send us to the third place kind of business nice 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 okay so mark of samoth we've we've heard about him in a couple of the notes that we've read and i think he's probably a so-and-so that guy at oh yeah we'll take this <laughs> oh that didn't kill him it hurt him but it didn't kill him that killed him all right yeah we blew up that entire platform um definitely take the metal scraps I wonder how many slots the medium chests uh, will hold. Hopefully they give us... Well, I would think they would give us at least one more roan. Hopefully even more than that. Alright, is there any... Enemies over there at the moment? No, we have a note though. Oh, there's a thingy. Just so it doesn't get us later on accident, you know? All just wood logs. Samoth demands it. Listen, you lazy brutes. Our leader, Samoth, demands we dig more elixir wells. This will give us all the elixir we could ever need. It will be dangerous work, but the risk is surely worth it. Dig, you fools, or face the wrath of Samoth. Yeah, I don't think the Samoth's a very good guy. Probably not. Probably not so much. Nothing going on up there. We got a thingy here. Some flame spells. Lots of copper to mine. What's going on back here? dog down with you All right, let's go up this way 
There's some baddies up here. Oh, nice. Jumped right in the mud. Uh, yep, yeah, we'll take all that. Let's also loot this. And, the, uh, yeah, that. Nice. Okay, let's go back up here for a second. That was just one of those things. Hey, we got a chest. Shepherd staff, uh, level 13 with 29 power. Um, well, I think what we have is better just because it's a, a rare as opposed to an uncommon. So we'll salvage that. Any baddies that we could snipe from here? Yeah, maybe. Can we do this? No, I can't quite hit that explosive. I don't want to keep wasting arrows. That's an interesting place for a bookshelf. <laughs> okay. Oh, you know what? I should probably take my food buffs. What do you think? You guys are probably yelling at the screen. Take your food buffs. Yeah, I know. I'm old. It's hard to remember to do that shit. Uh, while we're in here, I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want those. You know what? I don't even really want that. I've got so much of the better meat that, uh, yeah. I'm even going to chuck the cloth. Okay. I will take this and this. I'll leave the stone. Those two things we'll take. Nothing behind there. Wrong toolbar. Sometimes I have trouble um, with my left strafe key in this game. I don't know if it's the game or if my keyboard needs to be cleaned. It's probably the second thing. I do actually need to give my keyboard a, a deep clean. It's kind of dirty. Oh, guess who's stuck in the thing? Sucks to be you. Actually, not take any one, either one of those things. Okay, I don't really see anything over here. Anything significant, anyway. Likewise, nothing apparent over that way. Uh, we came... Yeah, we came through this way. What are these bookshelves doing here? That just seems weird. <laughs> it's more like a... It's, oh, yeah, we'll take twigs. Anything up here? No, not that I can tell. us to another chest. Ornate wood bow. And a note. And a, a repair thing. Nice. We have dug too far. Samoth, your greed for the elixir cannot be quenched. You keep it to yourself when you said you'd share. You're a liar. Or no, you liar. We, your people, die for you in these tunnels. For what? We banish you from our midst. To go now. Or we will show you the strength of our numbers. Find your elixir somewhere else. This is our mine. A little bit of a mutiny going on there, eh? Okay. Um, there's a bad guy down there. Ouch.
Alright, so... I'm a little bit turned around. Let's go back up here for a second. And we came around this corner here. And there's something back there. Alright. Oh, that's the uh, crucible. Nice. Okay. Very good. I'll take it. No, no, no. There we go. Some chain heal spells. That's good. Which we should probably take. Is there some more amber? I haven't actually figured out how to get that yet. Might as well re repair our stuff. was that tooltip that just popped up? I don't know. I think it was probably a glide tooltip or something. Okay, cool. So that was actually not too terribly difficult. Grabbing that. Let's um let's do a couple of inventory management things real quick. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of these. Um we'll drink that. And I'm gonna into that stuff too. Okay. So, how does this compare to our current bow? That's 19 power, that's 15 power. This would probably become 15 power if we upgraded it. It's going to give us backstab and critical, whereas this gives us piercing, backstab, critical, and mana leech. Or stam no, stamina leech. Ooh. I didn't even notice that before. I saw Leech and I just assumed it was mana. That's actually really good for us because I, I believe it, what that does is it takes 5% of the damage that's done and adds that to our stamina. So I still think, you know, this is still the better bow. But what we could do is upgrade this and replace it with this one. Um, I don't know. I'll have to think about that. I'll have to, I'll have to give that some thought. All right. So uh, this is probably the way back out. I don't think there's anything back there. Take both of those. That has to be a good place to come to mine copper. There's actually still quite a bit more to this mine. Uh, you know, if you just go up. Let's just investigate it a little bit more here. Uh, wonder what's all that creepy noise? Is it just ambient noise? Oh no, we came through here. Okay. Let's go up this way. I think that's just creepy ambient noise. Oh. I don't want to get too close to that um, thing, but he's close to it. <laughs> what? That did not kill him? That did. That should have taken him out, man. Um, Alright, can we get any higher? Yeah. There's somebody way over there. Alright, they're dead. Anything up this way? Oh, shit! Um, I guess we'll, we'll take that. I got tons of bones and I got tons of bone meal, so I'm not 
particularly inclined to to get those. Oh my god, that guy hit hard. He must have got a crit on us. And we need to heal anyways. Okay. That's just a stone there. There's some mana shrooms. Where does this go? Cave passage. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I'm gonna say that's a deadly shroud there. Sorry for the darkness, but... This guy's tough. Oh, good. We got him stunned. Uh, why don't we do this? There we go. Oh, shit. Didn't see uh, the pooch there. They do have a, I noticed a little, damn, a little bit of a problem in this game with, um, oh shit! <laughs> oh man, unbelievable. I was just getting ready to take a health potion too. Wow, okay. Um, what was I saying? I don't even remember what the hell I was saying now. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't remember. I don't remember, man. Okay. What I think I'm going to do is let's put the big health potions on the toolbar. But let's take one of these right now. Uh, I was just, I mean, literally a nanosecond away from hitting the potion button when that wolf <laughs> nailed me. Oh, man. Do we have repops already? Looks like we do. Okay. Um... I want to let's get rid of that. Oh, I still have my thing. You know what I'm going to do? Let's go home, get all fixed up, get the crucible thingy going, and then we'll come back here and get our stuff. This is kind of like uh, the same issue we had before, except for that before we actually lost the saw blade uh, when we died. Whereas this time it kept the crucible because it's probably just an RNG thing as to, you know, what you lose in your inventory. Okay, let's talk to this guy. What needs fixing? Time to craft a smelter. Ah, you found my crucible, huh? Was that journey too tough for you? It was actually kind of tough, but yeah. Uh, quit whining, Flameborn. Rekindling a flame takes time and patience. Right now, just crafting that smelter will suffice. Let's get to work. Okay, let's do it. Craft the smelter. Um, we got everything we need. It's a beautiful thing. I uh, be don't be rude and don't tell me to get out of my own house either yo okay where are we gonna put this monstrosity um we why don't we put it yeah we could put it right here this will work quite nicely as a matter of fact except for I don't like the fact that the crank is if the crank's gonna animate Okay, so we can only make copper ore at the moment. Fair enough. Let's grab a couple stacks of charcoal, and nope, that's not copper. Kind of looks like it. I've got a full stack of copper and then some. Oh, nice. Okay, so it doesn't actually turn the crank, because it was going to bug me if, if it would have clipped into the thing. That's actually not a crank anyways. It's a 
it's a lever to pour the uh you know the molten metal out it still would be in the way in real life but you know what oh actually that's kind of clipping isn't it all right we're gonna actually move it uh, mostly because it's, it's clipping i i just that kind of bugs me man i don't want it to clip got to be realistic about these things okay so we want to hold it out to about Oh, you got to load it from the back. All right, you know what? I'm, I'm not going to be that anal retentive about it. Let's just... Let's call that good not worry about it. Okay. Anyway, uh, we'll put that back in and that back in. And we can finally make some copper bars. Oh, and that's going to be nice. And then I can uh, make up a whole mess of copper arrows. I love it. Okay. Let's uh, sleep, repair... And then um, I'll meet you back at the mine, and we'll go in and get our stuff. All right, we are back. Let's buff up here. And uh, go get our stuff and see if there's anything else in this... Um, in this place that we have to discover. Why is it making that noise? That's weird. I've heard that noise before. And I thought it was supposed to be there, but apparently not. Alright, do we have full repops over here? Eh, maybe not. We already went down through there. That didn't help so much. Is this... Is this where we went? I kind of... I kind of don't remember now. There's a... Oh, right. Okay, so this was the repair thing, and this should be empty. Yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, if you restart the game, though, then that would have repopped, but then the whole place would have. Okay, so I think we were up higher when we were in that tunnel that we went through. Okay. Yeah, fortunately that doesn't hurt too much. Can't quite reach that. Uh, I, I mean, I can reach it from here, but it kicked me off. There we go. I think we we had gone around this way, right? Yeah. I don't have a lockpick on me. I certainly don't. Can we get some metal scraps? Yeah, we definitely didn't come up here. How many metal scraps do I need to make a lockpick? Two. All right, let me see if I can bust something and get some metal scraps going. Okay, I found some metal scraps. Make a lockpick. Open this guy up. See what we get. Some explosive thingies. Now, where does this go? We didn't come this way. We went around the corner. Oh, okay. I think this is just another path to get up through here. think there's anything over that way. Um, we had... I think we were up there, weren't we? Or maybe it was up here.
Alright, I don't know where this goes. Obviously, we're trying to go after our stuff, but I also want to finish exploring this place, too. There's a guy over that way. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. Are we done? So this completely leads out. Where are we at? Yeah, this just leads out of the... This is a, just another way to come into this place. Ah, oh, right. Okay, I know where we are. Okay, let's go back over this way. And I think... Yeah, we went around through here. Into this place, and this is where we got killed. Okay, let's make sure we're on the right toolbar. Came down through here, and there's our stuff. We had a wolf jump us that came from behind. All right, let's get our stuff first. All right. Where does this go? Oh, wait, no, that's the way we came. I, wait, is it? Yeah, this is the way we came. Okay. All right, so let's go down here. We can't go that way because that's deadly shroud. Oh, god damn it! I didn't even see him there. <laughs> it scared the hell out of me. Oh, heart attack. I see you. Yeah, we can't go through there. We're not quite big enough. He's resistant to frost, it looks like. Not that that's going to save him. Looks like it ends right there. Okay. deadly shroud right uh oh no it's not it's just normal shroud all right well we're gonna have to explore further then but let's top off it just kind of looks reddish is all do one more okay Big blue thing up there. And then the weird shroud water stuff. What is that thing flashing down there? Oh, it's a... It's a... Grappling uh, thingy. If that's there, that would suggest that there's something down here for us to get. This is a pretty big cave. What kind of monster are we going to run into down here? There's something down there. I don't know what that is. 
Can it get up here? Yeah, you keep taunting and let me kill you. These are level 15s, yeah. We're definitely on the upper end of our range here now. Okay. Um, the, the first guy we were shooting at... Oh, shit! It's one of those guys! Run! <laughs> Damn it. Damn it, Jim. What the frick? I was turning the wrong way. All right. You know what I'm going to do? Let's go back up here for a second. All right. I'm going to take one of these. I'm going to take one of these. Okay. Now we can do 30% more damage. Uh, but we still have eight minutes in the shroud here. I'm just going to... I'm probably going to end up getting myself killed again. Uh, all right. Can we... Soften these guys up a little bit from over here? Oh, damn it. Get back up. <laughs> I don't think they can get me from here. Yeah. How do you like that, sucker? God, I hope he can't jump up here. Keep it in the side of the... Got him. Nice. All right. Just trying to see if I can get to that other ledge. Um, let's take one of these and one of these as well. We'll go loot this guy's body. Is, uh, is that it? It's supposed to be a cave passage, which suggests it leads out somewhere. Oh, here we go. All right, it's put us into the shroud close to a flame sanctum. But we got to be careful because we got pretty high level baddies in this area for our level oh that's a lot of high level baddies yikes all right let's um no 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 don't do that let's try and archer these guys there's too many of them for me to try and melee all at the same time <laughs> There we go. Uh, where do we kill that that other one? Oh, right here. Okay. <coughs> Let's see if we can. That flame sanctum looks like it's up on top of there, maybe.
Out of the nastiness. There we go. Okay. Since we're here, see if we can get some copper bars out of these. Not that way. I guess we don't really need to now, though, because... Oh, we got a greater health potion. Because now we can make it. Oh, gosh dang it. I completely forgot I have Flask of the Fell. I haven't taken it this whole time. Oh, can't take me anywhere, you guys. Can't take me anywhere. All right. Well, we'll remember to, hopefully, remember to start taking it next time. Okay, so we're in really n far north here in to Revelwood. And you know what I think I'll do is let's set down a, a flame altar so we can teleport back here uh, when the time comes for us to need to do so, which will probably be fairly soon. Uh, just got to find a little bit of stone here. But guys, um, that is it for this episode. So I'm going to let you guys go here. And then, hold on, hold on, hold the phone. Here, let, before we go get ourselves killed, let's just, um, oh, go here, go here, make that, go here. Let's just put that down, okay. A mushroom walker guy glitched in the thing. Oh, this is just one of those um those hidey holes. Sometimes there's something to loot there, but I'm not I'm not seeing it. This would be a good place to to spend the night, you know, if you ran into one out in the wilderness and didn't want to go back home. Alright guys, well anyway, like I was saying. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here. Level 15 wild hog there. And um, in the next episode, I, I, I think what I want to do is do the hunter quest that gets us the, you know, finds her spindle so, she, so we can make linen so that we can then make better armor and whatever that other thing was that I needed linen for that I wanted to make. So that's the tentative plan for the next episode. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, uh, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you all in the very next episode. Ciao. Ow. Bacon's on the menu tonight, boys.